What's going on, America? This is Kevin in Kevin's Corner, and every once in a while you come across a work of art that is beautiful. It depicts the true hypocrisy of the funky, crooked, dirty, nasty, disgusting, poop stain, dumpster juice, nasty, crummy, doo-doo, snag-a-tooth-wearing, smelling armpits, liberal media, okay? Um, and Laura Ingram put this little bit together because for the last couple of weeks, ever since A.G. Barr mentioned spying, the liberal media and the Democrats have been having a fit. Spying? What I mean, what is he? How is he going to say our own, our own intelligence for spying on some? It was just surveilling. It was surveilling. This man's using inflammatory language. Inflammatory language. So she puts together a little reel of all the times they use the exact same language. Let's listen in and see the hypocrisy. Bill, I want to play something for you. This is various cable networks hmm. around April 10th. Let's uh -huh. watch. This uh, FISA warrant to to uh, surveil, to spy on Carter uh -huh. Page is in October mm -hmm. 2016. The application uh, to spy on Carter Page was 50 pages long. When they spied on former Trump campaign advisor Carter Page. The application to spy on Page was approved by the president's own deputy attorney general. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so last time. Well, no so, problem. um... I guess they just now threw spying out of the English or I say the liberal media and the Democrat language ever since Barr flipped it and pointed that term and definition towards their heroes, the people who was, you know, uh, staging a coup. So now all of a sudden when they are being attacked and accused of spying, then oh, you can't use that word or you can only use it against the people we don't like. So they use it. And then when Barr uses it, all of a sudden it's a major problem. Hypocrites, man. Hypocrites. And I wonder sometimes, before they get on camera, does any of the producers go back through some of the old footage and say, all right, now listen, you might want to stay away from this because if you say it, they're going to double trap you. You're going to look hypocritical. No, they don't do it. Because guess what? When they get out there and they say stupid stuff like this, yes, Fox News will catch it, point it out. We'll catch it, point it out. But their own viewers, who they rely on to have a low viewer IQ, Never go back through the archives. Wait, wait a minute. How many times you use spying in the same context? You know what? You're a hypocrite. They, they rely on that. And because they cover each other's back, nobody's going to tell on the other channel. They're not going to be like, hey, you know why? Because they get to talking points in the morning. Cross the board. All the channels. Like, all right, what's the uh, narrative today? All right. Um, okay. The walls are closing in. The walls are closing in. It looks like the walls are closing in. Today, we see that Trump... And his whole campaign, the walls are closing in on him. Don Lamont is truly looking like the walls are closing in. Yeah, they get their talking points every day. And they don't care if they look stupid, hypocritical, ignorant, malicious, just all types of horrible ways they look. They don't care. Eh, so what? Who's going to go ahead and criticize us? We're all on the same team. Anyway, you've been listening to Kevin and Kevin's Corner. Maybe, just maybe some wandering soul out there that's been following the funky, dirty, nasty, crooked liberal media might run across my video and see that clip and say, hey, wait a minute, they are hypocrites. So check me out every Wednesday night, 7.30 live in Kevin's Corner. If you didn't see the live broadcast the other night, it was off the chain, had some great callers. It was this one lady called in, she had a little Southern accent and she was keeping it 100. We had people calling in and really thanking me for the things that I do uh, and they almost, Almost made me get misty eyed. I said almost, okay? But, I mean, it was some wonderful words said, but the content was great. Uh, we had a great time and a lot of laughs, like always. You know, you got to laugh sometime to keep from crying. So don't forget, check that out if you can. If you uh, want, you can donate to Kevin at Kevin's Corner. There's a link in the bottom to do that as well. And check out Extreme Tees, my sponsor. If you like something you see, go ahead, click on it, put my name in the promo code Kevin, and you'll get a 20% discount. All right, and other than that, Hit like, hit share, subscribe, and the notification button. God bless you. See you next time in Kevin's Corner.